Hello, beautiful people of the internet. My name is Ryan, and welcome back to our Subnautica series here on YouTube. It is episode 72. And I've said this for a while now, but it's more true today than it was in the last episode. This might be our last episode. I really have no... Before some bonus episodes and some other stuff happens too, and don't worry. Below zero will happen before too long too. Don't be sad because it's potentially over. Be happy because it happened or something. Anyways, in the last episode, I just got done blowing my nose because, uh, partially because uh, I have a little bit of sickness going on, but also partially because I just got put through the emotional ringer uh, in the last episode. Um, yeah. We hatched the new sea emperors. We set them free upon the world. We witnessed the death, uh, we think, of the last grown sea emperor. We were cured of Kara and we set off the I didn't even look at the build I just realized I didn't even look at the building the alien containment facility like the shooting facility um after we powered it down um yeah and now it's time to think about getting off this planet in the last episode we waxed poetic a shit ton so I'm gonna do my best in this one to be a little bit more about the business of what's happening. Uh, you know, not, not at the exclusion of waxing poetic. It's like my favorite thing to do in the world, but the focus today is going to be to make the Neptune launching pod or whatever it is called. Um, that requires launch platform, two titanium ingots. This is like the rim world final push. Uh, we have to make the launch platform and then all of the pieces to the spaceship and then get out of here. Uh, we have to make a computer chip. We also have to make or have in our Inventory for lead, which we now have. Drop all this titanium. Uh, computer chips require um two table coral, one gold, and a copper wire. And copper wire requires two copper. So that's four table coral, two gold, uh, and four copper. I only have two copper. Cool. So I need two more copper. Let's turn this off and let's do sandstone. Yeah. How <laughs> can I never remember this? It's probably limestone. Now that I've said that <laughs> last potentially last episode of the day. And I can't goddamn remember. I had all of this shit open earlier. Um, it's fucking limestone. I'm a dummy. Ignore me. Limestone. All right. Uh, yeah. So let's do that. Um, I don't think there's anything else that I can be thinking of right now. Can I make one computer chip? I can make at least one copper wire and then one computer chip. Beautiful. So that saves us on inventory space and has us, uh, less likely to exit out of some items in our inventory uh, or like remove an item from our inventory that we actually need. So limestone chunks over here. Keep an eye out for creature eggs along the way just because you have to, you know, this is a, a sand shark one. Yeah. That one just says like, unidentified. Is that the same one that's in there now though? I think that might be the exact same egg that I currently have inside of the, uh, inside of the system. That is titanium, which I will take. Sure. Not going to hurt me to have it. Copper. One more, one more, one more copper. Titanium. Is that new music? There's like a... It's beautiful. It's like a... Uh, it reminds me of like a wind-up thing you would set on your counter with like a, like a... What's that called? Shit. Like a... Little wind-up figurine, you know? And it would like... Plink, 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 plink. Plink, plink, plink. 
Except much more beautifully than the shitty sound that I just made. Uh, yeah. All right. So Welcome that should be enough. Captain. Welcome aboard, Captain, to make our launch platform. Uh, I wonder how it's built. Habitat Builder? Probably. I probably heard this music like 16 times before and I just didn't know that. Mm, miscellany, no. Exterior modules, no. Is it a thing you build out of the mobile vehicle bay? It doesn't make a ton of, well. It is, that's funny. All right, cool. It doesn't make a ton of sense in my head, but sure. We're gonna do something a little funny real quick while we're here. Because why not, right? First off, we are going to change you to creature egg just so that we have it there. We are going to top off our food and water and top off this guy to make sure that he's still going. Uh, so that we still have power. Listen, I'm not just providing power for me these, day, these days. I'm also providing power for... Clarence and Ray, the rabbit Ray, or hold up. That seems bugged. Seemed real, but seems real bugged. Oh, well, um, okay, sure. Also, this is not an egg that I have found so far, apparently. Which is interesting. Can I finish building this uh, yet? I think I have a titanium in my inventory. Yeah, let's go. All right. In there, we can chuck you. Now, this is a song I've heard before. All right. Let's craft this uh, Neptune launch platform. Let's do it. Oops, almost ran right into the wall there. I did run into the wall. Shit. <clears throat> God, there's creature eggs everywhere. There's a bunch of them right there anyways. So, here's what I'm expecting. And I may be wrong. I mean, it's a fucking rocket ship, right? Here's what I'm expecting. Oh, that nearly crashed the game. I'm expecting for this to take more resources than any of the vehicles that I've made so far, and probably all of them combined. It's a fucking rocket ship. It should take a lot of resources, yeah? We'll see. That's my idea. Uh, if it happens to be very easy to get off of this planet. I mean, I already did the hard part, right? I can't wait to watch it fall. Pretty fucking cool. It's so loud. Wow. Pretty fucking cool. All right. Anything underneath? No? All right, cool. It's all got that Altera aesthetic, you know? Hell yeah. Ah, it's just a better mobile vehicle bay. I see. It's a better, you got your little, little guys. Neptune Gantry. Supports the rocket during construction. Takes a lubricant, a copper wire, and a plasteel ingot. Don't have the required material, ingredients. Yep, no shit. All right, well. Cool. I can't get down here. That's cool. Huh. And you can climb out this way. Oh, buddy, I should... Okay, so there's no way it's going to show up. Is it going to show up in here? It is. Oh, thank God. Okay. I was like, I should really remember this. I need more copper, it turns out. So, uh, real quick, just for fun, let's grab a couple creature eggs, if they're unidentified ones, and then let's go back inside. One of the things I'm going to do while I... While we uh, build the Neptune is just launch some eggs. 
Those are both things I've had before. That one I don't know. Oh, buddy. Okay. Should be a couple, like, right here. No? Those are deeper? Okay, sure. Nope, that is also the same one. Alright, cool. I think they're all going to be if they're in this area. I mean, it makes sense. Let's go check this one real quick. Yep. All right. Great. Wait, hold up. So it says... It says unidentified, but I already launched... I already hatched a, a sand shark. So, huh. I wonder if that's bugged or if that's like that there's more story to that i don't know either way that's not our focus right now i think i could probably hatch more than one thing at a time too so we might try that but i like knowing specifically which egg is which and i don't want to lose track of that are these oh shit are these creature eggs right here that's pretty close actually It's in the middle? Oh my god. That's terrifying. I didn't know you could do that. I didn't know you could go into the middle of the fucking jelly shroom. What? That's wild. Okay. Is that a slither that I just... All right. Check that battery out. Uh, do we have an extra computer chip? Did I make that the wrong way? So in here we have you and you and you. Um, I guess we could chuck this one in here. Do a couple eggs at a time. That blue guy's right there. Chuck you there. See what happens. All right, spade. Holy shit! Spade fish egg has been discovered. Was that the blue one? It was. Spadefish, I know which one that is. You're cute. Yeah, you're right there. Very small. Okay. Great. Well, sweet. Let's go ahead and throw one of these guys in here, too. That is a spadefish egg. All right, cool. So what do you think this is? It's not a sand shark egg? I wish there was a way to keep track of what eggs you had and what eggs you didn't have. Um. Okay, so we need... To make plasteel and I think the problem with that is that it takes yeah it takes 10 titanium and I only have nine so unfortunately we actually don't have enough titanium right now uh, or we have one lubricant yeah we do have one lubricant get rid of the computer chip so I need both titanium and copper which means that I'm going to want limestone for sh Oh, shit. Limestone for sure. And we're going to want to collect a full load of those. Uh, so, let's go do that. It's kind of nice getting to build this thing, having solved the vex the, for the enzyme, you know? At this point, like, rescue is coming. I am my own rescue, but, like, rescue is coming. Oh, my God, it blocks out the light. Um... <clears throat> Hope is an actual logical response to my existence here. And it was not for so long. <clears throat> okay. There's at least one limestone chunk here. One piece of titanium. Oh my god, these are all the other direction. Come on. There's gotta be one over here. There's gotta be. No? All right, fine. I wonder if I'll see less infected animals now that I have s that this baby sea emperors are out and about. You know, I bet I, w I bet I would. That's the exact same one that I've picked up sixteen times. 
Copper, beautiful. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. I'll have to keep an eye on that. Keep an eye on, like, how many quote-unquote infected um, guys I'm seeing. And also, like, am I going to see the Sea Emperors out and about, you know? I would love to see one, like, kind of close to my home. It's sandstone, but I'll take it too. Oh my god, this is... A little yikes. This is tight. Couple ones right here. Alright, beautiful. I love that you can tell how close something is by just holding space. Like, out of all of the different things on the horizon, the ones that sink to the bottom pretty quickly when you hit space are not all that far away. All right. Good old copper and titanium, both of which we're definitely going to need. I'm imagining the amount of titanium we're going to need is going to be huge. So really, I should just be mass farming that, but like, if I can get it while also getting the, uh, we'll grab these two and that'll put us pretty close, I think. It's not like I'm going out of my way to farm titanium, I'm just happening to find some. Uh, okay. So let's go for home. I need the oxygen anyway, so. Inventory's not super full, but not bad either. All right. I don't know. Now I'm just like looking everywhere for signs of life, you know, or like signs of increased life. Oxygen. Listen, I get it. I need some oxygen. Don't worry, game. I've done this a couple times before. I've only died like six times so far in this game. <laughs> Far too many times. But, you know. Uh, let's just take all of you. Make one plasteel ingot. And then I have lubricant. What was the other one? Was it copper wire? I should check that first before I do anything. Yes, it was. All right. Well. Let's go for it. Um, all right. Everything's green. Let's go for it. Let's see. I It, it appears. We'll see if this continues. It appears that it's going to give me one item at a time. Which I kind of like. How do you build a, a, a spaceship? I have no idea, but the game tells me you build it one item at a time. <laughs> I don't know if you know this about me, but I'm not a, I'm not a rocket scientist, but that might just be the part of me that really likes following checklists. <laughs> Construct. Oh. Let's get the sideways view. Hell fucking yeah, baby. Oh man. That's gorgeous. Holy shit. It's got a screen over here too. It's interactable? Call elevator. Holy shit. Holy cow. All right. Ah! This is how you die to fall damage in this game. Holy shit! You walk right off the edge. That's how you do it. Oh my. It's making me a little... It's a, I don't want to look down. Okay. Wow. Very cool. 
I wonder if you can I wonder if you can get crushed by the elevator. Um, all right. <laughs> Just like stand underneath it as it's coming down. Next is Neptune boosters, which are going to require plastic ingot, nickel ore, aerogel. I knew I should have been grabbing fucking rubies and shit. And a wiring kit, which is two silver. Okay. So doable. Doable, doable. All right. We may end up having to go back to our... No, we grabbed extra nickel. The last time we were down there, we grabbed extra nickel. Let's go. So at least for this step, I think we may have most of what we need. Minus uh, titanium, which we're going to need a shit ton of it anyways. But wow. Last time we were down in the, you know, semi-depths, we... Uh... We grabbed extra nickel. Um, okay, so first things first. Let's change you to titanium so that you can get to, to metal salvage so that you can get scanning. And then let's grab... Oh, we're going to need more lithium too. Uh, maybe? No, I've got... That's lead. Shit. Drop off a lead. Drop off all my copper. I have two nickel. Fuck. Shit. All right, well. In that case, never mind. Um, I can make a wiring kit, which I only need once. So that's good. Success. Let's chuck it in. Power cells is our, no our new go-to... Uh, holding place um i do not have enough titanium so we're gonna need to go grab more of that plus more lithium plus more nickel let's see if we can make two aerogels it appears that i can so is it one plasteel ingot or is it two uh one and then it's three nickel ore all right great so go ahead and grab that chuck both of these over here we need more nickel and also more titanium well uh first things first i can grab the titanium and the nickel is actually not gonna be uh the problem is I have to that means I have to go back to the alien base. So it's not gonna be easy to get, but hopefully it won't be that hard. We'll see. There's a couple this way that don't appear to be too far. Those appear pretty far. Okay. Just grab as much metal as we can. Lithium will... Oh, shit. The problem with lithium is we need the prawn suit back here. I think it's time to go get the prawn suit. Oh, yeah. Because uh, I, I farm the... I, like, mine the lithium. All right, well, time to get the prawn suit back. Should have some metal salvage over here. Beautiful. Oh! Hey, you know what? You little son of a bitch. Crash fish, motherfucker. You know what? I'm not even gonna hold it against you. It's a scary world on this planet, you know? I don't even hold it against you. You being scared and coming to attack me like that. I mean, I think you would be a little bit more grateful, considering uh, I'm the reason you can continue to exist here. But, you know... It's fine. If you want to show me your gratitude by attacking me, who am I to tell you that's that's the wrong way to do it? I mean, I'm here to tell you that that's the wrong way to do it, but I'm here to tell you. Oh, inventory full. All right. Back home. Where? I've gotten lost again. Should be right here. Yeah, yeah. 
Is the map? This is a question that I feel I feel comfortable asking now. We're here's the interesting thing. I haven't really referenced this in recent episodes, but we're at a different part of the playthrough now. Um, I would still prefer to mostly keep this as blind as possible. Uh, I definitely want to keep. I should rephrase. Definitely want to keep the playthrough blind. Uh, what has changed a little bit is that I have some questions that I don't think will necessarily affect what I'm doing now. And for that reason, I don't feel bad asking them. So here's my question. And you guys can answer them, and, and it doesn't really endanger me of... Uh, endanger the playthrough. Here's my question. Is the map the same for every player? I'm starting to think it must be. I think it has to be, actually. Yeah. Because... At first, I was thinking, like, there are points of interest, and then areas in between that are maybe randomized. Is there any randomness in the terrain generation here? I don't know. We have a shit ton of titanium now. Uh, it's still not going to be enough, but at least we have a start. Uh, I've decided to use the guy to try and get some shale chunks. Uh, out of which I think you can get lithium. Yeah? Diamond. We'll see. All I need is one more lithium to get the item that I need. But made. Lithium. We're still going to need more, uh, we're still going to need more our, our prawn suit back and such in a future episode, but for now, we have the lithium we need. Uh, okay, so, ores, chuck those, and also diamonds we store there for some godforsaken reason. Uh, let's make a plasteel ingot. All right, so I think we are now one nickel ore short. Yeah, of what we need. Cool. So that means I'm going to chuck you in here. Uh, I'm going to take both of these full power cells. And I am going to take, uh, don't think too much about this, okay? I am also going to take in my inventory the stasis rifle. Uh, okay. Let's go eat a bunch of food and then we'll go to the... Back to the Cyclops. I don't know that we'll get there this episode. Um, but... We'll, uh, we'll do our best. Beautiful. Everything's powered up again. All right, we turn the scanner room off since we'll be gone for a while. And we need nickel. And I'm trying to, I don't know if we, we probably need some kyanite, actually. They probably, if I had to guess, they probably make you, in the process of building a spaceship, you have to have materials probably from every stage of the game. So my guess is that we are also going to need some kyanite. Um, so we should just plan on grabbing some while we are down there. Welcome I'm actually going to repair this because it's kind of weak. Is it like 70%? 80... Beautiful. Alright. So... Headed for the island. Cool. All right. Well, I think that will do it for this episode. And uh, frankly, north, northeast. Frankly, that is going to do it for my recording session. I am going to leave the rest of the construction and leave, you know, the next steps uh, for my next recording session. So, uh, 
there you go. Another recording session coming on where we did not actually reach the ending of the game. But I'm having a good time. I'm not... I'm certainly not upset that we have not uh, finished the game yet. Um, in fact, sort of the first thing I'm looking forward to doing when we have beaten the game is opening up a new save. Is that an insane thing to say? That's why I keep saying I think we'll probably end up streaming this game on Twitch a little bit. Uh, I have an idea for something I want to do. I'll talk about all that later. I have an idea for something I want to do uh, in a playthrough. So anyways, thanks so much for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed uh, the process of building a big-ass fucking rocket. I mean, we haven't gotten there yet, but we will see you in the next episode. Until then, I hope you have a great rest of your day. If you enjoyed this, I would love a like and a comment down below. They help us out a ton. In the meantime, I will see you tomorrow. All the music stopped. I should really just let it go. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.